Oh no, I'm running late. I hope there's not a lot of patients waiting for me. Let's head into the toy hospital and see what's going on. Hi there, I'm so sorry for the wait. I'll try to get to everyone as quickly as possible. In the meantime, there are some surprise eggs in front of you. Feel free to open them up and play with whatever's inside until your name is called. If you need any help, my assistant's right here. See you soon. Hi there, I heard we can play with these surprise toys. Can I open a couple of these eggs while I wait? Sure thing, let me help. Let's open this yellow egg for Chase. I wonder what's inside. Hmm, a piece of paper. Oh, it's an imagining page. And check it out, it looks like we got a Spongebob one. Let's get started on this right away. Hot feet, color the picture. Can you find a jellyfish, plankton, two anchors, and Mrs. Puff? Okay, let's start by coloring this page. Take a closer look. Alright, were you able to spot the jellyfish? Jellyfish is right here. Color this in. Okay, did you find plankton? Plankton is right here. Let's color plankton. Nice! Two more to go. Did you find two anchors? Here's one and two. Last but not least, did you find Mrs. Puff? She's right here. Nice! Great work, everyone! Wow! That was so much fun! Can we do another one, please? I want to open another egg. Sure. This time we'll open the pink egg. Oh, it's another piece of paper. Did we get Imagine Ink? Yes, we did! And it's another SpongeBob one. Let's get right into it. Who is the fry guy in space? Color the picture to find out. Alright, let's do a picture reveal. Do you know who this is? Let's finish coloring. The Krusty Krab delivers, and the fry guy in space is SpongeBob SquarePants. That was so much fun! I think they're calling my name now. Thanks for helping me pass the time. The wait wasn't bad at all. See ya! Hi there, Chase. Once again, I'm sorry for the wait. No worries, Doc. We all have those days. I know you're really busy. I actually came in because I've been having an upset stomach for the past few days. I thought it would go away after some rest, but I still feel uneasy. Oh no, that's never a good sign. Let me have my assistant run a few tests, and then we can try to pinpoint the problem. Wait right here. Hey Chase, heard you're dealing with an upset stomach. Hopefully it's nothing serious. I'm gonna start by checking your heart. Okay, everything looks normal on that end. Let me take your temperature. Mm-hmm. It looks like you don't have a fever either, so that's good. Now I'm going to check both ears. Make sure you don't have any infections or anything like that. Most likely I won't find anything since you came in for a stomach issue, but it doesn't hurt to check. Almost done. Your ears are fine too. I'm going to relay all of this information back to Doc, and she'll tell you what's up. Okay Chase, your vitals look normal, and nothing else seems to pop off the charts. So I'm assuming you just ate something bad and got food poisoning? But not to worry, we can take care of that right away. I'm going to give you a shot and some medicine to help with your uneasy stomach. Oh, sorry to hear about your food poisoning, Chase. I was really hoping it would be something more minor. That is not pretty. I'm sure the doc told you, but I'm going to give you a shot first. This won't kick in until later, but when it does, your stomach should feel much better. And to help with the immediate pain, I'm going to give you some quick cure. Drink this up. Awesome! Let me go bring the doc back. Hey Chase, everything is done, and you should start to feel better really soon. The quick cure is only temporary. You still need to go home and rest. Do not eat anything else for 24 hours, and once the shot kicks in, you'll start to feel much better. Oh, you're right, Doc. I don't feel queasy, and my stomach is slowly starting to get better. Although, I think I need to go into the restroom again soon. That's normal. Just go home and get some rest, and take a closer look at what you eat moving forward. Maybe check the expiration dates on some of the foods, and if anything smells funky, toss it out. Hope you feel better soon. Thanks, Doc. Will do, and I'll see you next time when I come in for my annual checkup. Bye. Don't worry, George. We'll see a doctor soon. How are you feeling right now? Ah, my teeth hurt really bad. I need to get my mind off of it. 
Um, Osmer Assistant, can we open some of the surprise eggs, please? I think that'll get my mind off the pain. Of course. That's what the eggs are here for. Let's open this orange egg. Oh, nice. It's another imagining paper. Let's get started on it right away. Reveal the missing area. Then count how many similar items you can find in the picture below. Okay, let's color in the missing area. Nice! Let's start with Gary the Snail. I see one, two, three, four, five, and six. Let's check. Ten. Oh, I thought it was just a missing area. Whoops, we need to color everything in. Sorry. Yeah, that would make it 10 because there's four Gary the Snails that we missed. Let me quickly color again. Alright, let's count all the squid words. Here's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. Let's check. Nice, we got it right. Okay, now let's count all the Sandies. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. We counted 9. And that's correct. Great work, everyone. Let's finish coloring this page. Whoa! That was awesome! I love imagining! And I was so focused on the activity, I forgot about the pain. Can we do another one, please? Yep. We have this green egg, and it's all yours. Let's open it up. Nice! George will be happy about this. It's another imagining. Let's work on it right now. SpongeBob Cassette Pants. Color the picture. Can you find a striped star, a purple spiral, SpongeBob's initials, and Sandy. Okay, let's color this picture. Do you see a striped star? Striped star is right here. How about a purple spiral? The purple spiral is here. Did you spot SpongeBob's initials? SB is right here. And last but not least, Sandy. Sandy's on the bottom left corner. That was awesome. I want to do more, but I heard my name. Let's go, Daddy Pig. Hi, George. I'm sorry for the wait. What brings you here today? My teeth hurt. Wait, where's Daddy Pig? He was with me just a minute ago. It's okay, George. Daddy Pig will see you soon. I just wanted to have a chat with you before. I'm sorry. I thought it'd be okay for us two to chat. I'll make sure he sees you before we check out your teeth. Let's move to the other room and get the examination started. Hi there, Daddy Pig and George. I'm Doc's assistant, and I'll be checking George out. Sorry, George. I heard you got a little scared earlier, but here's your dad. George, I'm sorry. I thought you would be okay talking with Doc McStuffins alone while I handled some business, but I'm here now. Looks like George is at ease, so I'll get started. Oh, okay. I can see some of your teeth already have cavities. Let me use this mouth mirror to take a closer look. Make sure there's nothing more going on. Mm-hmm. Yep, that's a cavity for sure. And this one back here is a cavity as well. Now let me check the top. So far, just cavities. I don't see any rotten teeth. So the good news... You can keep all of your teeth. The bad news, we are going to have to drill a few of them and fill them up, but you'll be good as new after. Get all the gunk out. Oh yeah, look at that. You don't want this. Okay, now I'm going to drill the cavity. There we go. Now let's fill it up. Nice. Let's clean this up. Perfect. Do the same for this tooth. Drill. And fill. Clean this up. Awesome! The bottom teeth look good. Now let's work on the top cavity. Clean the surface. 
Let's do some drilling. And let's fill this up. Almost finished. Awesome! Let me do one final check. That looks good. This looks good too. Last one. Alright George, you're good to go. Okay George, I took care of all the cavities so you shouldn't feel any more pain. If you do, please let me know now and I'll have to take another look. No, I feel great. Thanks so much. I don't feel any more pain. Okay George. I'm gonna go to the front to finish up. Doc McStuffin said she wants to see you, so meet me outside once you're done. Hi, George. I'm just checking in on you. I heard from my assistant that everything went well. <coughs> yes, Doc. Thanks for everything. My teeth feel like brand new. That's good. Just remember to watch your sweet intake and always brush and floss your teeth after you eat your meals. Have a great day. Will do. Thanks again, Doc. Oh, I was wondering why no one was in any of the rooms. We don't have any more patients. Thank you, Osmer Pop, for being such a great assistant, and I'll see you again soon. Bye. Awesomer Pop fans, thank you so much for watching. We can't do this without you. If you're new to the channel and became a fan, click that subscribe button for more awesome stuff. And if you want to be the first person to watch our next video, hit that notification bell to have a chance. See ya!